How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another Hogwarts Legacy video. So capturing all the different beasts is absolutely essential in Hogwarts Legacy. You're going to want to go out and capture all the different beasts so you can use their parts for different upgrades for your gear. And trust me, you're going to need a lot of those upgrades when it comes to some of the late game content because some of the combat encounters can get pretty crazy. Not only that, but capturing creatures is a great way to make some extra money. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you the locations of all of the different creatures that you can catch in Hogwarts Legacy. But before you can capture creatures, you have to have progressed far enough in the story that you've unlocked the Room of Requirement and you've talked to Deke. And then once you unlock the Room of Requirement, after you progress a little further in the story, once you make your way back to the Room of Requirement, Deke will greet you and give you a tutorial mission on how to capture different beasts. And then once you complete the tutorial mission, you will then have access to the bag, which you can use to capture all the different amazing creatures scattered throughout the land. So I'm going to show you the locations for every single one of the creatures, but do keep in mind the two final creatures are creatures that you're going to have to get through progressing through the story. If you want to capture yourself a graph horn, you're going to have to get pretty far in the main story, and then you will come across the graph horn during a mission. And then once you capture one of each of the creatures, if you go back to Deke in the Room of Requirement, he will give you one final mission where you have to go out and save a phoenix. So the phoenix is the very last creature that you can save in Hogwarts Legacy. It's a little little disappointing that you couldn't get a dragon. I was definitely hoping that you could get a dragon at some point, uh, but the phoenix is still definitely pretty cool and you're definitely going to want to get him. So if this video helped you out, remember to hit that thumbs up button. It's greatly appreciated. And remember to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future Hogwarts Legacy videos. So with that said, let's go ahead and jump right into the locations. No need to be difficult. I mean you no harm. Settle yourself. I mean you no harm. Do cooperate, won't you? Everything's all right now. Everything's all right now. <laughs> Professor Howard will never believe this. No need to be difficult. I mean you no harm. There, there. 
not going to hurt you. Rebellion. Rebellion. Levioso! Oh, no, you don't. And then as a reminder with the graph horn location, this is where it's at on the map. But like I said, there is a mission that will specifically trigger towards the end of the game where you will meet one of these guys and you have to complete that mission before you can get him to spawn. If you come to this location before completing the mission, he won't be here. So hopefully this video helped you guys out and I will talk to you all next time.